Hi, Simon from Serif here. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how you can use Movie Plus X6 to create a picture-in-picture -picture effect featuring multiple videos on screen at the same time. The ability to create picture-in-picture -picture effects is a heavily requested feature, and I want to show you how you can take the effect even further. In Movie Plus's media pane is a video of a snowboarding trip that I've split into four separate scenes using multi-trim. Each scene is roughly the same length. The plan is to create a montage by displaying each scene on screen simultaneously. To achieve the desired effect, I first need to add three new video tracks on top of the existing one to Movie Plus's timeline. I do this by right clicking on an existing track and choosing Insert Video Track. Now it's simply a case of dragging each scene onto the timeline. You'll notice that each video track has its own audio track. Four audio tracks playing at the same time is going to be very irritating, so delete each track. There's always the possibility of introducing audio or even adding a soundtrack at the end. Now that I'm left with just four video tracks on the timeline, it's time to resize each track so all are visible on screen at the same time. I do this by initially choosing the top track and selecting Transform from the Properties pane. In the Video Preview window, I'm now presented with a pane which gives me the opportunity to rescale the display. Before I do this, I'm going to turn on Guidelines from the Guides and Borders menu. This is helpful because it divides the screen into quarters. To make the sizing process clearer, I'm going to zoom out of the video preview window, select the top right hand node and simply drag this down to the bottom left hand corner. Now time to select the remaining video tracks and repeat the process so that all four quarters display a different scene. With each track now resized, it's time for a quick preview. For additional impact, I'm going to stagger the introduction of each scene. An easy way to do this is to adjust the start time of each track via general properties. If the first track is visible from the outset, 0 seconds, I'm going to adjust the remaining tracks to commence at 3 second intervals. Now time to add a transition to each track. Select each scene in turn and choose a transition from Movie Plus's gallery. 3D Flip is a good one to choose. You'll notice that not all tracks finish at the same time. For speed, I'm going to crudely clip each track so they're all the same length, but you'll probably want to play with the scenes in and out points via the trim dialog, so you don't run the risk of trimming out any of the best action. Further customise your montage by adding a background and music, and experiment with timings. <laughs> 